Welcome back to our channel, Motion Trainer. TMZ verified with a Meta spokesman on Wednesday that Ye had been placed on a 24-hour ban for posting content that violated Instagram's harassment, hateful speech, as well as bullying regulations. This indicates that he simply wouldn't be able to use the site to comment, post, or even message anyone. This is something that we all could actually see coming. However, in this video, we will talk about the probable reasons why Instagram had to take this step. Let's begin. So the entire issue began with Kim Kardashian sharing her opinion on the recent chat involving her boyfriend Pete Davidson and Kanye West, her ex-husband. According to a person close to her, Kim is appreciative of his presence. According to The Insider, he's been a fantastic companion and has been around for her throughout his journey. Handling Kanye and managing the kids with him has been quite challenging. According to the source, Kim is really impressed with Pete for sticking up to Kanye's continuous insults. She is quite grateful. Pete is patient and laid back, and she appreciates that he is standing up for himself. However, she believes Kanye's behavior is pure foolishness and that enough is enough. She's overjoyed that Pete stood up and hopes Kanye can finally move on, the person said. To which Kanye answered, and he did it on Instagram, as is his custom. He began by sharing a photo of North's bag, which has pins of Kanye West, Kim Kardashian, as well as a green alien. It was on my daughter's backpack when I was allowed to see her last week. This is the caption that he wrote on the post. He even continued by saying that that is why I work so hard in order to provide for my family. My instinct is to defend my family at any cost. However, as my family's priest, North God is still alive, so don't worry. Please stop with this storyline. You were all here this morning taking up the kids for school. Kim commented on the very same post, but this comment is now deleted. The entire situation seems only to get worse. So Pete was chastised in 2019 for making a joke about having intercourse with babies at a stand-up act. Pete told a story about watching one of his friend's children on the show. The baby had been teething at the moment, and what happened was that the child began sucking Pete's finger, which Pete seemed to have joked about, I don't want to F this kid, but he demands it. Pete went on to say that he would not like to have sex with just about any newborns, but if he had to, he'd pick his friend's child. Pete Davidson infuriates the crowd with jokes regarding having sex with a baby. Kanye captioned on a post with a screenshot of a story. Again, another point why Skeet gotta keep away from my children, the caption read. Oh, and no one noticed he didn't show up for Saturday Night Live. Since Mr. I can assist you with meds, that seems to have a mental collapse after taking him off the internet. Skeet, you're not designed for this, and I've already blacked out the Super Bowl for you. Please apologize to your family for being in their family. The way Skeet utilized Kim's relationship status to confront Kanye was a stealth dig towards her, and Kim didn't quite catch it. He said in a snapshot of a remark on his earlier post, Kanye captioned the screenshot with, I'm worried that Skeet will lead to my children's mother becoming addicted to narcotics. So every two months, he goes to rehab. So Dave Sirius is a comic who shared Pete, as well as Kanye's text messages on Instagram. Kanye shared a photo of himself with the comment, Please Dave, assist in creating more culturally irrelevant jokes for Skeet. These days you don't need ability, all you need is a Hillary Clinton tattoo. This remark comes particularly because Pete actually has a tattoo of Hillary Clinton. Another reason for the ban might be that following a Daily Show episode in which the talk show host highlighted Kanye's vicious abuse of ex-Kim Kardashian and frightening threats that were made towards her new lover, Pete Davidson, Ye reportedly left a racist slur on Trevor Noah's account. You may well not feel very sorry for Kim since she's rich and famous, Noah added, before adding that although she is among the most powerful person, as well as one of the wealthiest women in the world, Kim is still incapable of getting her ex to stop contacting her, stop pursuing her, stop pestering her. However, it's terrifying to observe what she's going through, he concluded. It also focuses on the struggles that so many women face when they decide to leave. So these are the probable reasons why Kanye got banned from Instagram. In the comments section, let me know the other reasons he could be banned.